straighten that front leg, pop the hip back. We've got our triangle pose. We're here for 10 breaths. Um, option for lifted arms. So you have the option here to cue and then they're going to lift. So it's super challenging on that side core, so as <laughs> and abs. Uh, so definitely just an option. They can always try to lift just one out here and then that top arm would follow for intensity. And again, you're facing them at this time so that you can mirror. Our release is going to be pyramid pose. So we shorten that stance up, straight legs, square the hips, forward fold, and then we'll step it in, standing mountain to vinyasa and repeat on the second side. If you'll repeat that series, um, that last one we just did, as many times as possible. Uh, if you're coming up on the 40 of the hour, then it's probably time to start moving into core and depth. Uh, so after that, we're gonna meet at the top of our mat. We're going to inhale, left leg and airplane five times, okay? And then we're gonna go into handstand kickups. So you're gonna do five times there, then that right leg stays planted and we're going to kick up with the left. So we're working and asking them to work on getting those shoulders directly over their palms, meet them a little bit farther and practice those kickups. Then you're gonna go to the second side, right leg lifts, airplane five times, kickups on this side. Then we're gonna release to our belly, locust pose, so top of the feet on the mat, bring the hands together, inhale, open up, then right cheek, tee those arms out, exhale, lift, left cheek. Then we've got right leg lifts, pigeon pose, holding here, uh, and then optional quad stretch. So they can flex that back foot. They can come up on the left hand and reach back. Or they can stay on that forearm. Or they have option to go to pyramid or mermaid. Or we'll repeat on the second side. A release is going to be straddle, forward fold, straddle to the right, and straddle to the left. And then starting from uh, the feet, um, this is just an option. You don't have to do this at the end of your class. I personally really love being guided through this. Um, and it's also a great tool for people who struggle with um, falling asleep easily. Uh, so if you can, you have nature sounds in the background, whether that's a nice gentle brook, just the sound of the ocean, um, something very peaceful and calming. Um, but more nature sounds I think really help because their eyes are gonna be closed and so you're gonna ask them to envision being alongside a body of water, whatever that may be. So the idea behind this is they're gonna be on their backs. You're going to start at the feet and work your way all the way up to the head. Now the thing is you're going to ask them to activate and engage specific muscles, hold for five seconds so you're not counting but you're counting in your head, release. So we start with the feet, clench the feet as tight as you can, release. Now we're going to activate all of the lower body. Squeeze, activate glutes, um, hamstrings, calves, feet, flex, everything you've got. Squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. So tight your heels might come off the mat and release. Then we're gonna move up to the core in addition to all the lower body. So activate your core, squeeze your lower body, everything together. Squeeze, 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 and release. Now we'll go into the arms in addition to the core and the lower body. Squeeze, 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 biceps, triceps, palms clenched together. Five seconds, release. Activate that chest this time. So everything below the, the neck is squeezing and pulling in towards one another. Release. Now you're gonna do uh, activate like the neck and the jaw. Squeeze, clench everything you've got. Release. Now the eyes and the forehead, basically total body at this point. Squeeze, 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 squeeze. Five seconds, everything you've got, curl it into the tightest, tiniest little ball in your mind's eye, and release. And then you'll go into the final.